In today's video, we'll break down two crucial components of your car's ignition system, the starter and the starter solenoid. We'll explain what the starter does, discuss five key reasons the solenoid is essential, and help you recognize the symptoms of a bad starter solenoid. But before we continue, hit the subscription button and turn on the notification bell to be the first to see our video. Let's dive right in. Let's start with the basics. A starter in a car is an electric motor that is responsible for turning or cranking the engine to start the combustion process. It engages with the engine's flywheel, allowing the engine to spin fast enough for fuel and air to ignite in the cylinders. This small but powerful motor is activated when you turn the ignition key or press the start button, and it works in conjunction with the starter solenoid, which plays a crucial role in completing the electrical circuit to the starter motor. Five key importance of the starter solenoid. Now let's talk about the starter solenoid. The starter solenoid is an electromagnet that acts as a switch, allowing electrical current from the battery to reach the starter motor. Here are five essential roles it plays. Number one, electrical relay. The starter solenoid is a relay between the battery and the starter motor. It helps transfer the high current needed to power the starter motor, which would otherwise require huge wires and switches. Number two, engaging the starter motor. It moves the starter's pinion gear to mesh with the engine's flywheel, allowing the engine to crank and start the combustion process. Number three, prevents overheating. The solenoid provides a high current relay mechanism to prevent the ignition switch from overheating, which would otherwise happen if the full current needed to turn the engine was routed through the ignition. Number four, controls current flow. It ensures that the current only flows to the starter motor when the engine needs to be started, protecting the electrical system from accidental engagements of the starter. Number five, automates the starting process. The solenoid automatically disengages the starter motor once the engine starts, preventing it from keeping running, which could damage it or the flywheel. Five symptoms of a bad starter solenoid. Now, how do you know if your starter solenoid is failing? Let's explore five key symptoms. A failing starter solenoid can exhibit various symptoms that may make it hard or impossible to start your car. Here are five common symptoms. Number one, clicking sound. When turning the key, one of the most common signs of a bad starter solenoid is a clicking sound when starting the car. The solenoid may not be able to send enough current to the starter motor to engage the engine properly. Number two, engine doesn't crank. If the solenoid is faulty, the engine won't crank at all. Turning the key may produce no sound or the dashboard lights flicker, but the engine remains off. Number three, starter stays engaged. After starting, if the starter solenoid sticks in the on position, the starter motor may remain engaged after the engine has started. This can lead to significant damage to the starter motor or the flywheel. Number four, intermittent starting issues. A faulty solenoid may sometimes work and sometimes not, causing the car to start intermittently. This inconsistency indicates that the solenoid's electrical contacts are worn or failing. Number five, burning smell or smoke. If the solenoid is stuck or damaged, it may cause electrical issues that result in overheating. This could produce a burning smell or even visible smoke from the engine bay. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, hit the like button and subscribe for more tips on keeping your car running smoothly. See you in the next video.